Well, alright then. Welcome back to Strafe. We're gonna try a speed run this time. And the only reason we can actually do that is because teleporters don't break that. Like we can we can use these. If we had to go all the way, like through the Icarus, through everything, it would just be impossible. But we can start on the burbs and be okay. Uh, the problem here though. We, we do start the zone on full health, uh, full armor, but our gun isn't updated. And that has a chance of being a problem. Especially when things start off this chaotic. Hello. Yeah, see, our, our ability to do damage is pretty limited right now. So, these enemies, which are not super tanky on the whole, they're still, like, they're very difficult to deal with now. It takes almost a whole clip to blast that thing. And, of course, we don't get a blessing right out of the gate. I, I thank you for not, like, actually trying to do anything. Um, there we go. Now, even though we're, like, starting off a little ahead of the game, we still have to, like, try to move quickly. These things, like, they just don't know how to handle the situation, apparently. Um, come on. These guys are still as uh, squishy as ever, so they're not a problem. Some ammo in here. Yeah, like we just got started. And we're already down 36 armor. We don't have any overheals, of course. Um, it's not really worth uh, looking for a barrel to try and hit that up. We have like no scrap either because. We haven't had a chance to pick any up. So we'll go hit this up. Now this is like if we managed par, you know, if we use that as like our uh, our target, we would actually reach the final boss with plenty of time to spare. We would only take 24 minutes. Um, we are not going to make par. We don't make par on a normal run, let alone one where we're starting off underpowered. So, it's it might still be a little tight. We might actually have to go back in the future and do it, like, straight from Athena, which does not give us much opportunity for, uh, for beefing up before the final boss. We actually may have to take the jobby route to even be able to do it. Um, which is a different achievement and we're not gonna try that one today. Ideally, we would actually do that one uh, when we hit the, uh, when we hit the, the, uh, the challenge for not having a primary weapon because Doing the final boss with Jobby makes that whole thing just, like, irrelevant. Up oh, here's the exit. And we got through in not terrible shape. Not great shape, but not terrible. Um, 347. Still didn't make bar. Of course we wouldn't. Um, how do our stats look? Yeah. This is a problem at this point in the game. No items, only four stat ups. So we gotta we gotta play better. We gotta play this well to uh, to manage the speed run. That's why it's an achievement. That's why it's difficult. That's why the game is taking a while to load. There you go. Thank you. That looks weird. That looks very weird. 
Um, I'm going to try to throw a barrel at that because that doesn't seem right. I don't think this will be like the uh, a secret room or anything, but how dare you snipe. And we got a grunt, like, in the background with that grenade. Not quite enough for an overheal. And that wall does look like a, uh, a secret weapon wall, so... We might try that one as well. What did we take damage from? Is the question. So that was a little weird. Um, it's like a loop backwards. Every, everything about that position just there seemed odd. Well, maybe not everything, but many things. Get you taken care of. Ah. Acid jumpers. I mean, there's, there's a good chance we die. There's a good chance we fail this. This achievement. There we go. Damage up. Yeah, these enemies are just like, they're acting a little weird right now. Um, we got spike boots in that crate. So that's good. Got clipped by that. That spit. Come on. Took a lot of hits there. Um, there was a barrel. I'm gonna try back here. Nope, no such luck. It's not guaranteed to be a, uh, a secret weapon. It's just, we've seen it a couple of times. go. 47 HP is not a good place to be. But we found both fuses, like, right next to each other. And accuracy up. What do we get stuck on there? I don't even know. The game is acting a little weird today. We're getting reasonable amounts of money, though. That is helpful. Because uh, we're going to be relying on the shop a fair bit after this. Okay, so here's the fuse room. We have to hit the power plant. But that is at least a little progress in that direction. There's the power plant. And it's got an acid spitter. And we didn't one-shot it like I had hoped we would. Spike boots helping out a little. Trying to uh, to use the inherent chaos of this area and the uh, the tightness friendliness of the shotgun, and we did okay. 
Uh, the, the main metric on that is we're not dead. So, success! Now we just have to find where we opened up that secret. Because we opened one up. And we could use it. Whatever's in there, we could use. Is it like over here somewhere? It is not. It's not there. Where are you, secret chamber? Where are you and your goodies? I don't think we're gonna find it. And that was bad straight jumping, a little over eager. Uh, we don't really like this upgrade that's available to us, so we'll just move along. Hit ourselves with the the frag. Okay, gotta go this way. That grenade worked well. That one didn't because we hurt ourselves a little, but the one right before it, that was brilliant. And uh, we got another spitter over here. One shot, one kill. Do the same to those boys. And anyway, we're taking some serious hits now. Okay. Don't want to get too close. Don't want to get too close. Um... Especially don't want to get too close to that plasma rifle when you're firing it. We've uh, seen what can happen there. Uh, we got a shop, and we got our scrap bin. We didn't even see it last floor. Which kind of sucked. So what you got? Reload blast, regen. Not enough money for regen. Fine, we'll take rainware so we don't have to do worry about acid anymore uh, but not being able to get regen is that's a problem and that's enough of a problem that it might have made more sense to go back that's also a problem um, it might have made sense to go back and uh, find uh, an exchange find a scrap exchange to get more money but we need the scrap because we need armor. So you're you you play low on resources when you do a teleport, when you do a speed run. Let's uh, just throw a gun at this acid dude and blow him away one shot. None of these boxes are having f are they're not containing food. That's really all we want is food. We also want 300 more scrap. That does it. Anything down here? We've already been down here. Starting to get the feel for strafe jumping. Might be helpful long term. Who knows? Let's come down here. We get a machine gun. This isn't the route. I didn't see the uh, the path to the next place, so kind of figured that was the route. Ah, over this way. Just throw a barrel wantonly to no real benefit. Wow. 
I mean, that kind of sucked, but at least we're immune to the acid now, so... Not the worst thing. All that murder zone time is starting to, uh, to pay off. Those little bits of practice are helping. Get a little money, a little more money. And a turret. Shooting out a lot of uh, our secondary fire. Oh. So there goes all our armor. Should maybe switch to one of our secondaries when we're dealing with those shotgunners. So they're proving a little difficult, a little too robust. There we go. There is a secret right here. Heard it open. It's got to be somewhere in this direction. We just have to find it. One bit of food in the dispenser. Um, I think that is an upgrade that we actually do want. So we'll hand it over and see for ourselves. Yeah, I believe this is the flechette shotgun. Yes, it is. So this could be a pretty nice boost. The flechette shotgun, you know, really does help. But we still need a good damage stat to really take full advantage. Um, otherwise, we're just shooting around a whole lot of nothing. Someday I will understand that gun, but today is not that day. Alright. Pop these boxes. Grab that. Grab this. Disc launcher. Lovely. Not saying that sarcastically either. I do quite enjoy this gun. So, where are we going now? That's the way we came. I think we're going up. Right as I was about to say, I think we're going down. I see. Nope, we're going up. Don't want to use the. Uh, the spin fuse are in short range. It's a little hazardous. I'm going to call it the spin fuser, like, forever. That's its name, as far as I'm concerned. So that worked. Um. Nearly, uh... Nearly pulled a stomp on that shotgunner. Which is more about... More about being snazzy than actually, like, being effective. Although, like, a stomp is an instant kill, so that's pretty effective. On the whole. Um, I want a barrel. If I can... Managed to find one for us. There's one. Just kind of holding out on dreams of secret weapons. They're not all even, like, that good. But it's the notion of having one. And, you know, gaining some benefit from that. 621. It's not too bad. So we're going into Athena on 1826. And we have 40 minutes. That's the... The benchmark for speedrun uh, for getting that achievement. So we're okay. We're almost halfway through and we've used about half the time, but we have to go a little faster. 
this time. Um, yeah, put in damage. Always put in damage. Uh, cause, you know, we have used more... Well, we've used about half the time, but the burbs is a little, little faster. Not by a ton, but it is a little faster. Because uh, these enemies are tougher. They're more annoying. And we're already, like, pretty damaged. So we maybe should be just, like, finding ways to ignore these enemies as much as possible. But, uh, that's not the situation we're presented with right now. Okay, you need to just die already. You need to get blown to bits. That was just that was that was style points. Um, we need to find secrets as much as possible. And uh, we need to dodge a lot better than we have been. And you just get die already. Sheesh. Um, so yeah, we are really like on the lookout for for secrets and for not getting hit. A 50 LD one three a soldier. Um, I'm gonna go continue. We're gonna try that again. Um. Let's try it with the machine gun this time. I don't know which weapon will be best for this. Um, I just highly doubt it's the railgun. So, we'll try a machine gun run, see how that fares. Get on down here. One grenade still didn't destroy an acid spitter. That's the, uh, the situation we're dealing with here. As far as our damage stat goes. But at least we got a nail gun, which is nice. Barely survived that one. Uh, we have a crafting bench super early, so that's... Not really beneficial. Get out of our face. We don't want to... We don't want what you're selling. Let's knock your head clean off. Got a little food, so we're getting more overheal. We gotta check every crate. Just in the hopes of finding something good. Uh, plasma gun is something good. Getting pinned is not something good, so we had to kind of handle that situation. I may never understand that gun. I just, it's not going to happen. I wish it would, but it's, it's not going to happen. So let's gather up this scrap. Hit that food dispenser for a little more overheal. Let's hit this bin. Don't see any secret panels. We don't really need them yet. We'd only be interested if they were, uh, if they were armor, because our armor is fairly low. But that's really it.
Get a clip extension. No such luck. Easily handled there. We got a good amount of scrap. Uh, we're not going to go all the way back to this floor's crafting table, but you know, next floor should come in handy. And uh, now we're starting to take real health damage, which is not good. I found some food, found some more food. So we're actually on target to overheal fairly soon. We're finding lots of ammo, which is appreciated. As is you dying after like three grenades. Oh well. How do we do on time? 348. I think that's exactly how we did the first time. So, okay. Uh, but we're in a good position with scrap, at least. We're, we're over the 6k mark. Which is what we really need. This door's not quite closed. That's a safety hazard. Let's get rolling. Thank you. Thank you for dying. Nothing in there. I do see an acid spitter. Um, I think I see multiple, actually, so that's unfortunate. I see one way over there. One a little closer. That is currently not dead. And has made us much closer to dead. So you can understand my dislike for them. I swear that grenade just like... That grenade hit him square on. I'm convinced. Of course, those shots hit me square on, so we are in a little bit of trouble. The nail gun should help. But, uh... You can, you can probably tell I'm, like, getting a little nervous about this run. Already. Yep. Yep. We are in bad shape. That really knocks him back. Yeah, we just got cornered. I mean, to be fair, I was trying to use a weapon that I really shouldn't have been trying to use. Let's do one more. Let's do one more. Um, if we're successful, this will be just like a normal length run. Or normal length video, at least. And if we're unsuccessful, we'll be right in that sweet spot. Whoop! Almost went to the Icarus. Don't want to be doing that. All right. Let's see what we got to start. And through this. Birthday party. We're at 90 paintings destroyed. This is a little jobby that we do not want to pick up. So where, oh where, did little jobby go? Because there was an achievement for killing a bunch of them. I have a feeling we already did that, just in that whole spray. So, goodbye, little jobby. You are appreciated, but also useless. On this run, at least. When we go for, like, that achievement, there is, like, a batch of them. Uh, 
uh, in Athena 4-1 right by the beginning. So that would actually be like the easiest one to pick up. We're getting some of the rats like pretty easily. Not even trying to find them and we're finding them. More damage. Bunch of enemies coming around this way. Not a problem. More reinforcement for the idea that shotgun might be the weapon of choice for this challenge. That or I'm just like getting so used to using the shotgun that you know it's best for us just you know just based on that. It's not actually the best weapon, but it works best in these circumstances. Come on, man, I threw a gun at you. Are you not gonna die from being hit in the face with a gun? Nothing there. Crafting bench is nice, but we don't have nearly enough scrap yet. Yep. Let's go. Get that. No. Kirk. And do the same before that one has a chance to retaliate. But of course, there was a third that we didn't notice. Because of course there would be. And what's this? Oh, this is the uh, the explosive machine gun, which I'm in favor of. It's a nice weapon. Some more damage. I gotta kind of sneak around the acid a little bit. We don't have rain gear. There's our scrap bin. There we go. Plasma gun, nice find. And getting them all on a stairwell is also quite nice. Especially when we could then use that and kill approximately not enough of them. Come on. There we go. So that's everything. We can gather up this scrap. Secret? No secret. And let's get out of here. 412. That's a slow one. That's not good. And we're below 100 health, and we have no armor. Uh, eh, this is gonna be a rough one. Uh, stuck in the loading screen. Like, I'm trying to check our stat. There we go. Three and one. Is it always that, like, there are four containers as well? I, I don't know. I wouldn't be surprised if that it were, like, consistent like that. But I also kind of would be surprised if it was, you know, that repeatable. A couple turrets here. Get that. Get some lucky, like, flechette snipes on this. Uh, avoid the water as much as we can, just because it slows you down so much. Um, and we'll check that because we always check that. It's our favorite spot to check. But it's rarely, rarely a secret weapon. 
It's mostly that, you know, we hold out hope. Um, got one spin fuser shot left, and we missed. We stopped the acid jumper, if nothing else. So that's good. We got a hostess right here. Okay. Basically no food in that, but... One is still better than zero, I suppose. I can make that argument. There we go. Fully healed. Starting to get a small overheal. We sh that shot hit you like square in the face. That was the most face shot of face shots. Oh well. Oh well. Let's head on into here. Into this absolute chaos. Got that. I think we actually handled it well. It's another secret panel. We saw one in that exact same spot earlier, and it didn't seem to actually open up anything. So, a little confused. But there's more overheal. That's the wrong way. I think we want to go down here. Almost took fall damage from all that running around. All that jumping around. Okay, we're about to get pretty busy up in here. Feels like. Oh, bad dodge. Decent shot. Not as exacting as I would like, but we pulled it off. Let's gather this scrap up. I haven't seen the crafting bench. Where was the crafting bench? I'm hoping we didn't miss it. And then instead it just has not shown up yet. Knock you down. There it is. There it is. It's a little stat boost. This run is going a lot better. Um, it's also a bit slower. I have a strong suspicion that we're... We're running a little behind time. Because I think we're playing this more... Like a... Traditional... Run. And not... Trying to go fast. At least not trying to go fast enough. And we have no money, so... We have 65, but we have basically no money. So, we'll just carry straight on. And, uh, see what our time was. Eight something? Five. Five forty-two. Okay. Not even at the ten minute mark. After the first two levels. That's good. And we're at full armor, nearly full health, with three ticks to an overheal. Um, it does almost feel like you're gonna... Like, if you can go fast enough with these... You can, wow. Um, I'm pretty sure that was a, a hostess, like, on the tracks that got us. 
So that sucked. Um, and having the bench so early also kind of sucks. And I have a sneaking suspicion that that barrel didn't actually kill. Oh, wow. That is a lot. At least we pinned them all, like, in the same general area. Uh, there's not going to be anything down here. And that feels good when you can pull those off. It's like going crazy fast and still manage to, to, uh, to hit the enemy. That's good. It feels good. This is a bit of chaos, I will fully admit. But I think you can, like, you can really see how the railgun would just not work for this. Because we're hitting so many chaotic situations, and the railgun is more of a precise weapon. It's more of a uh, planning, you know, preparing and all that. And that's just not something we're going to get to do here. We're going to get to use a weapon I don't understand. <sighs> that was your doing, man. That w we had nothing to do with that. Like, this is really, really potent. But, you know, that fire delay... But when they stand still, it's it's quite lovely. And that just explodes. Nothing fancy. Let ourselves get pinned just a little. Um, I don't know where we want to go next. I'm. You know what, we're already headed this direction. Let's just keep it going. Okay. We don't have spike boots, remember that. back here. Do I have this to pick up? Is there something down here? I believe that's double barrel. So we will take this upgrade. Yep, that's double barrel. So we should be doing a lot more damage now, which is good news. Because we're taking a lot of damage. Um, go. Yeah. That's potent. Does have a little bit of a fire delay, though, so... Don't get up in our face, dude. It's impolite. There's a little more money. There's nothing up here. So we're through the burbs. Not in the best of shape, though. We're good time-wise, 15 minutes. We very nearly hit par. Very near. Um, but our health is not in great shape. 
our time is like the only thing we got going for us right now. So we'll see, uh, we'll see how this one shakes out. And we're off. Um, uh, let's, let's take damage. I feel like you should always take damage. Uh, damage up, like, don't. No, you shouldn't always, like, get hit. We shot our grenade out of the sky. Like, I'm kind of mad, but I'm also impressed. Alright, we gotta get moving. As always, looking for secrets. I feel like that opened up more in this direction. Okay. That soldier, like, run out of ammo or something? A lot of, uh, a lot of things with guns. There we go. Double kill. Nice. That was overkill. Um, where was that secret? Like, I know we gotta move fast, but... We kinda do need that secret. Um, whatever it contained, we need it. But uh, no idea where it is, so yeah, just soldier forth. At least that gave us you know, a lot of. Uh, a lot of food. Destroy that. Crack that open. Even with all these damage ups, it takes two shots to destroy those things. Nothing! Grumble, grumble, grumble. So we gotta find more secrets. That's what it comes down to. We gotta take all the armor we can take. And I haven't really figured out like where might a secret weapon be. I haven't really figured out those archetypes yet. Is that all the hostiles? It's all the hostiles. And that's all the scrap from that. I mean, good amounts on that front. We can just, like, get on out of here if we so choose. Oh, we probably should choose, but those little bits of money could really come in handy on the next floor once we uh, once we hit that shop up. So yeah, now we're at 150. We can afford most things. And we really wanted to find that. go 431 not too bad right 1934 total this could be the run I don't want to uh, to count chickens but we're not in bad shape
That barrel helped us out a bunch. There's no secret up there. That wasn't the right type of grate. More damage up. That's very useful. Plasma gun, also useful. Let's figure out where we're headed. All that armor, and they still go down to one melee hit. It's appreciated. Okay. So we have enough scrap for... for another bit of armor. Come on. Come on. Tear those things up. And uh, we will need to gather that armor. ASAP, because we're out of it. So, we still have hostiles. There, there are a few of them. Let's do our sweep. Hello. I mean, that was a very big hostile. But I think we still have some small ones. Still one remaining. No idea where it is. We'll take our 50-50 health armor. Just carry on. I think we can have that, uh, that bit of scrap. And here's the shop. So what can we find here? Barrel pole, airbud, speed. We take airbud. We might as well take Retro rockets, even though they're not necessary. And uh, we get out of here under par. That is lovely. That means we can find a crafting bench. We're almost at. Uh, weird positioning. We're almost at uh, a full armor purchase already. And we already have full or half armor, almost. Uh, so we don't need that much. Thank you, Airbud. All right. There's no reason to go around trying to grab that money. I'm not going to do us any good. Those things still take two whole grenades to uh, to deal with. It's kind of annoying, but those grunts they die nice and quick, and in a, a very amusing fashion, I would say. Ah, I've missed. We're getting flanked, so. take care of one thing at a time. There we go. Got another squishy soldier. I think
think he uh, clipped us a little. Did a little bit of damage. That's the direction we came from. We're running around in circles right now. Not the, uh, not the best look. Uh, there's nothing over here. Okay, no secrets, no nothing. Gather this scrap up. Two shot that. We have plasma gun. A weird gun. Like so it's like a sonic wave kind of weapon, I think. It's like really hard to tell exactly what's going on with it. This is a lot of fire. This is very, you know, this is fine. It's that kind of thing. It's like, just very yellow. There we go. And we got a, uh, Squishy somewhere around here. Also had a secret, which we hit up, and it's food, which is absolutely wonderful. Um, can't seem to find the uh, squishy dude right now. There he is. He's stuck. Um, Two threats. Oh. One threat. Not gonna bother looking for it. We just need a crafting bench. If we find that, we're actually in really good shape. Blew up a computer. That was not our target. We have nothing against you, computer. Okay. Poorly aimed grenade. Let them follow in one by one. situation is not terribly good. We really need that crafting bench. Like, even though we're trying to do speedrun, if we missed it, we have to go back. Um, we also have to figure out how to get out of this level. It's probably this way. Um, this isn't the uh, the end. This is just the last segment. I hate how much armor those things have. They are just super durable. But they can't stand up to plasma. Not terribly good. Um, we don't want to sell scrap. We would actually prefer to buy it, if at all possible. Um, 49 clips. Full armor, half health. To be honest, I didn't even pay attention to our time. Um, our time was fine. Like getting in here, and we hit par, our other ones weren't that far over time, so I think we'll be okay. 
just like try and clear these out as much as possible. I'm not gonna pretend this isn't tense. This is a little difficult. Little scary. Um, that did an okay amount of damage. Whoop. No clue where that missile is coming from. Plasma guns, all right for this purpose. I don't think that explosion actually did what we wanted it to. Okay, well that turret's gone. That turret's gone. No clue where... There are some baddies. There's a lot of baddies. Okay. We're, uh... Running kind of short on... Getting these, uh... These cores defeated. Well, now we got two of them, so that's progress. Just have that uppermost one. Fifty-two HP. And we got the blood flood. And we did it. We did it. Now to get the hell out of here as fast as we possibly can. Um, because this blood flood is really slowing us down. Whew. We might have done it. So we head over this way. I, I think this still like counts towards our time. So, we gotta move. And for all we know, like, that boss fight might have taken too long. One hostage. Brr. Where did we miss one? Where did we miss? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Down in here. There we go. Let's get over to the terminal. Speedrunner! Achievement unlocked! That was tight. We don't, we don't get like a final screen, so we don't know what exactly our time looked like, but it was under 40 minutes. So that is another achievement in the books. And uh, that'll do it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, like would be appreciated. Subscribe doubly so. Either way, we're going to space. Ta-ta for now.